Hi, my name is Justin Conway. I'm an Excel expert, and I'm going to walk you through the steps to finalizing an Excel worksheet. Um, the finalization process uh, can be tailored to your liking, but I'm going to do the four-step process, which uh, entails first spell checking your document, um, then error checking your document to make sure that all of the functions within the Excel sheet seem to be working properly as long as uh, as far as Excel can tell. Um, then protecting the different components, and that's a uh, two-step process. So the first thing that we're going to do is spell check. In the review ribbon, you'll see to the left there's uh, a spelling button. Click on the spelling button, and you'll be given the option to check uh, various words in your document that come up as possibly spelled incorrectly. Um, they'll give you suggestions on how to change those words, uh, and if you think that the spelling is correct the way it stands, you can hit ignore. We're going to ignore that because it's a name. And actually, they're all names in here. We could just ignore all on this. And let's proceed to the end of the spell check. Click OK. That portion's done. Next thing to do is to go into Tools and go to Error Checking. This is going to make sure that, uh, again, all of the functions seem to look correct uh, to Excel. And Excel did a quick check through, and it looks like everything's good. It gives us the OK. So we're going to go ahead and click OK to get out of that. Next thing we want to do is make sure that all of our information is secure and safe and uh, won't be lost necessarily um, you know, due, to, due to any accidents. We're going to protect our workbook. First thing that we're going to do is click in the review uh, section, go into workbook, and we can add a password if we want to, or we can just go ahead and click OK, and that'll make, uh, that'll make the workbook itself protected. Let's add a by uh, password in here real quick. Okay, so now the workbook is protected. And then this, the last thing that we want to do, step four, is protect the sheet. We'll click on this area, and it'll give you a drop down, a list of different things that you can select that you want to protect. And let's say we also want to protect the editing of deleting columns and deleting rows, because that's sensitive information, and we don't want anybody to be able to uh, accidentally get rid of that. So we'll add the password again. Click OK. And now, if you try to delete any information within the document, it'll prompt you saying that it's protected. Your Excel sheet is now finalized. That's how to finalize in Excel. My name is Justin Conway. Thank you.